Hey guys, my name is Steve with LRM Leasing. I want to talk about shaking. Now, I know that's one of the biggest issues in trucks, considering as big as it is, 10 tires, the thing I always hear is shaking, the front end, the rear end, and so forth. So there are quite a few things that you can do to try to eliminate or minimize as much shaking as possible by making sure your tires are properly inflated, shocks are up to date, you got correct alignment, tire inflation, all that kind of stuff plays a role in the shaking. You know, drive line, even height of the airbag. I had a customer come in this week his complaint was shaking in the front end. The interesting thing was when he drove it bobtailed, no issues, smooth, straight as an arrow. But once he adds the trailer to the truck, all of a sudden the truck starts shaking violently and then it's also pulling hard to the left. So I know most shops don't do it, but what we did was just trying to determine what the cause of the problem was. I went on a test drive with this guy. We noticed that the trailer was hanging over the line and then we also feel that the truck was definitely shaken. Remove the trailer, no shaken, and the guy spent a lot of money on tires, alignment. Nobody paid attention to the trailer. What we need to do is sometimes, as drivers or owner operators, is look at the trailers. It could be because of the tires, the shocks, the suspension, and also the alignment. And sure enough, when we put the alignment machine on that trailer, we found that, that it was out of spec, the shocks were blown, and the tires were worn so bad where it made everything shake. The cause of the problem was the trailer. If you know that the common denominator is the trailer when hooking up, pay attention to the trailer. Not everything is going to be the truck. All right, so if you don't take care of the trailer and it's doing all that, it will cause damage to your tractor, causing definitely irregular tire wear. When you're trying to hold onto the steering wheel, your truck wants to go straight, but the trailer's trying to pull you in a different direction. And that will give you uneven wear on the tires. And then not only that, it could be a possibility where your alignment could go out as well. So just don't always uh, ignore the trailer, but also pay attention to the truck. So if you can get the alignment done, the bushings, you know, making sure the tires are properly, it'll save you money even in fuel consumption as well. Once you start driving the truck and everything's as straight as an arrow. All right guys, just remember to pay close attention to your tractor and your trailer. You're gonna save a lot of money just by paying attention to those few things like the alignment, the tires, and things like that. I hope a lot of this would help with the issue with the shaking. If you have any questions or concerns, please leave me a comment at the bottom. Stay tuned for more videos coming out, especially when it comes down to maintenance and saving money. If you liked everything you see, hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe. See you in the next video.